Hey everyone, thank you so much for checking out the channel. This is Earth Angel 111. Hope everyone's doing wonderful today. Great to have you back to all my returning subscribers and welcome to everyone new. Um, so I was just doing a reading, a quick twin flame message is what they want to say to you today. And my camera completely like froze on the video. So I just left it where it is and we're just going to say it from the hop. So essentially how your person is feeling about you today is they see you as someone with a mission. You could be working on something. You have a current goal in mind. Um, with the Empress card here, you could be a Taurus. Otherwise, they just see you as someone who's really standing in their independence, um, their knowing of oneself and what they want. They see you as someone who has the ability to manifest essentially anything out of nothing. Then we got two love messages here. The first one we have says, every time I pray, I include you because you are such an incredible blessing in my life. Absolutely. What a beautiful message here. And the next message, so this could apply for those in separation as well. The longer we are apart, the feelings I have for you grow stronger every day. So that's just them acknowledging that if you two have been separated, instead of them running away from the connection or maybe being cold, and they may even be playing it that way. They want to let you know that they do care. And the longer that this relationship kind of goes on, the stronger their feelings are towards you. So absolutely beautiful messages. Um, what I'm really feeling with this though is they see you're doing some sort of plan of action. And it feels like they want to be a part of it. I'm going to pull one mystery message just to keep it spicy and see what kind of comes up. Oh, we actually had one pop out. There we go. So let's see what comes out in the mystery messages for how your twin flame is feeling about you today. First one out. I'm sorry. So they're acknowledging, acknowledging, <laughs> acknowledging that they're apologizing. <laughs> acknowledging. It's a new word. The solution is coming. So if you've been stressed out about something, spirit saying, hang tight, answers will be coming, news will be coming. Maybe it's whatever you have the, the visionary for. Next out, we have manager. So I'm not sure what that means. Um, maybe you're being promoted to manager at work. Uh, maybe you're looking for your own manager or maybe you're just dealing with the manager issues. Next out, we've got singer. So, wow, you could be a singer and you're actually looking for a new manager or a manager in general right now. Maybe so you can expand. Next, we've got third party. And last message out we've got is just a hater. So, Spirit's acknowledging if you've been worried about someone or they've been giving you a hard time or whatnot. Don't worry about it. They're just a hater. Spirit's saying keep on going. Um, but for these messages, what I'm feeling like is there could have been a third party situation. This could have caused your person, uh, your twin flame and you to go into separation, whether it was on your side or theirs with the manager and the sorry. So they're acknowledging their sorry. And yeah, with manager and singer, you could really be someone that's looking for some sort of talent scout or rep if you're in the music industry yourself. I think these are some beautiful messages. Basically what your twin flame just really wants you to know is that they want to come forward and establish like a new sort of connection with you. With the visionary card, it could also imply that they are looking for a new vision for this relationship. They want to establish new grounds, new, um, let's say, traditions, new beliefs, new coming togethers, like new ideas, new ways to bring the two of you together and to really come together as one there. So I think that's absolutely beautiful. And they're just acknowledging too, like with the visionary, maybe that they see exactly what you're trying to achieve and they don't want to miss that. They don't want to see you be an empress because they know you'll get your emperor regardless if it's them or not. Right. So I feel like they're just acknowledging that there, that they want to come in and make it better and I keep getting this message about people reaching out around planet retrograde so if you've been in no contact 
I would say in February for sure, expect some sort of reach out. Don't expect anything huge. I mean, they could just put their foot in to test the waters, but they could possibly send you like a text or leave you just a voicemail or send you a thoughtful card in the mail, something like that, just to let you know that you've been on their mind. What a beautiful reading though. I really hope that resonated for you out there and I hope you have an amazing day. Sending light and blessings and until next time, this is Earth Angel 111. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video for more content. Take care.